Hi everyone and welcome to my channel, Blue Lotus Garden. My name is Blue Phoenix, my pronouns are she, her. This is where I share my found knowledge on care for plants um, and then behind the scenes of what I do behind the plant shop. Um, yeah, and so in this video I have plant chores. Um, there's also going to be clips of the little chickens, the new ones around, so you'll definitely be seeing the new chickens in the video and then also the ones that I've been hatching so the one from the previous videos if you saw it um, you could take a look at that and uh, that's our previous videos uh, that's our previous video on how to how I've been hatching um, chickens so it helps me out with like my hobby with caring for them and just providing a more healthy lifestyle for uh, myself um, and knowledge lots of knowledge also so this might be a long video. There's a lot to... Oh, look at the one little chicken. I have this friend right here, so... Gotta put it back, but... Hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so... This looks like a big pile of green mush, but it's not. It's a lot of sweet potato. I'll insert a clip, a little picture here of what uh, my friend was doing. She pulled out a whole bunch of uh, sweet potato from your yard. And so we have some and we're gonna be uh, putting some for the take a plant, leave a plant, some for the yard, uh, backyard, and then just to grow and keep around. So stay tuned. Um, I'm just going to my, maybe like do a fast forward of it. I'll be having like be with my little dog here. So you're just gonna be, enjoying a relaxing propagation of um, <laughs> this big pile of sweet potato. There's like, they propagate by water. So if y'all know, and then I might just be putting them in here. Um, but I also have a, um, an event. So uh, I might be bringing some just cause. <laughs> It's looking a little bare, so this might help it out. Okay, so, so far I have gotten through one pile. So I have all the little like hearts, what I call them, the little potatoes. And then I have a pile of like sticks over there and some over there and some over there. Sorry for the noise. Okay, so, um, and then I'm gonna work on this and that and I'm gonna just make different piles and probably like different like planters and then just bring some to uh, bring some to um, the Liberty Lounge where we have our plant swaps at so I'll definitely be bringing one over there and then um, planting some over there so you'll be seeing a future video if permissible <laughs> of, of us doing um, the fixing up the place over there with some uh, plants of ours so sorry i got bit by mosquitoes there's like so many out here ah okay what i'm gonna what i'm gonna do is that's buddy that's buddy okay what i'm gonna do is place my bird of paradise in there and i'm just gonna put a whole bunch of sweet potato vines in there and that's gonna look really cool as my like outside planter okay so these are my piles <laughs> oh here's one more so i have my piles like that and then um this one i'm going to go take to the liberty lounge to see if i can plant it there for them um and then just uh look around and take care of their plants a little bit um and i'll make a little video for y'all if, if if permitting um and then i have my compost pile over there the big old one it's a bunch of like 
dead foliage, just like bad looking um, stems, nodes and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna toss it over there it's for the chickens. Sweet potato vines are not toxic to, to chickens. So um, they are okay for them to just peck at it. And then I'm gonna show you how I clean it and then be done with it. Well, I'll plant it later. Okay, so I placed them over here because I like to be over there. And then, if you walk with me, place them here. They like to be here also. And then over here. So, and in case they do move it around and this starts growing in the ground, well, good. That's, that's the whole purpose for it. So, thank you, chickens. <laughs> See, that's, that's how they start. You gotta look around and see what it is and if it's okay and if it belongs here. And if it is, then they'll be all right with it. And they won't freak out. <laughs> So if you see right there on the right, right hand side, that's um, marshmallow, marshmallow. Marshmallow is on our uh, flock tee, so when he was a baby, took pictures of him and got little pictures and now he's all grown up. Marshmallow update. <laughs> That's twisty right there. A little twisty. You call it twisty because she has a little cross beak. You gonna dance for me? You gonna dance for me? Give me a little dance. <laughs> now they're curious.
thank you for the eggs. Baby girl. Thank you for the egg. Thank you. Today, I am going to propagate my Monstera Thai constellation, add it to my store, get more plants for my store, more things that we need. So we'll definitely be propagating it. As you see, I air layered it on the bottom base. Um, if you've been following my progress, I've grown this from a node, from basically a little like wet stick. So I'll put a picture here if I can of it. Um, but yeah, it's been growing big. Like it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is the newest leaf. Look at that. So we're gonna be propagating it today and adding it to the store. And then uh, hopefully like having a little boost for our store, you know? So thank you all for the support and I'll definitely like have it all prepared for y'all. So if you want to check out my store, it's linked down below, down below. Okay, so I'm going to show y'all how to propagate this plant. So I'm gonna zoom in real quick. So as you see, it has this nice root right here, and we're going to cut And we're going to cut it from between here. So it will be sliced by a knife right in, be in between here, right there. And then um, I think this part. Yeah. Because then it'll be, it'll have this root, this new root, and then it'll have this root as well. So. I'm gonna show y'all how I did that. Actually, I lied. So as you see here, I'm gonna cut where this black part meets. So we're gonna do that and go from there. I think it's nice about that. No, because the eye is right here. So we're going to want to cut here. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay. So I just made an incision. Oh my God, it has two roots, so it's good. And the other parts are very well rooted, as you see here. Um, and then I think I can take out another piece. I don't wanna like disturb it too much, but I'm thinking I can. So let me see if I can. Do y'all see where I'm like about to cut? I think it can go right there. Oh my God. I think I cut this big part. Yeah. Oops. Oh my God. Well, I did it now. Well, this is what I cut. I think it's a good good um, amount. 
I'm just, I'm not gonna like cut it anymore. I'm just gonna leave it like that. It's one, two, three, four. So it's four leaves, four, four leaves and a big old root. So we're just gonna have to like leave it alone, allow it to callus overnight and then um, get to it tomorrow. These are very prized. They're something like I worked really hard on growing these out. This is something that I just really did so that way I could get more I could like help my store out some more. Um, so they're definitely gonna be sold. Um, and then we'll be seeing how it goes from there. I'm excited. I hope you all like it. And um, I really hope uh, that whoever receives these enjoys them. Uh, they're in great care and I've taken such good care of it. So they're gonna be in good hands after that. All right, I'll see y'all tomorrow when they're all callous and we'll pile them up. So what's great is like, I get to keep a little part also. So it's just like that and we'll reroute it again. The little nodes are inside here. So they'll be growing out from there. Yeah. Inside there, so we'll be I'm like, I'll just chop it off. <laughs> so I'm excited. Um, and yeah, I'll, I'm definitely, I'll probably have them ready for like the event that I'm gonna be at um, this Sunday on the second. So if not by then, um, I'll definitely have it by my swap for my swap event. So I always have like a monthly plant swap um, in a very supportive LGBTQI plus um, environment so I always welcome everybody to come by and enjoy yourselves and just have a good time get to know one another and just uh, swap plants meet local vendors new ones that you might have never uh, known about or some that you do um, everybody's been super supportive towards me and um, like I said I've been focusing on my transition so I really <clears throat> have been surrounded by a whole bunch of people that are super supportive. My parents, my mom, my dad, my sister, they have all are super supportive. Um, I am very blessed to have this in my life and I um, am going to continue sharing this so that way I will share this, bless this amazing time with you all as well. Oh, and if you join my Patreon, I do, I do like silly fun like shirts, and I customize them for my Patreons. There's a really fun new one that I've done. Um, I might have a put a picture up here for y'all. I'm ranting off a little bit. I just like talking to y'all. And you're always welcome to um, follow my second channel where I talk about my transition and play with makeup and show you all my experiences and shopping and all the fun stuff. So, all right. I'm rambling off a little bit. So all right, everyone, I want to thank you all so much for watching my video and my Patreon member, Hani. Thank you so much for that extra support. It really helps us so much for all the things that we do in our operations. Y'all have an amazing day. Y'all are so fabulous. Bye, everyone.